Hey y'all, it's your girl and welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see by the title, today I'm going to be straightening my 4C hair. It's in like a bun right now. Y'all, can y'all see the growth? Can y'all see the growth? Because I was not able to put my hair in one ponytail last year. And now we can, okay? Even though it's all messed up and stuff, I'm gonna go wash my hair. Y'all already know my wash day routine. Um, I jumped into this video so fast. I'm Coconut. If you haven't met me, seen me before, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. Um, subscribe, make sure you guys follow me on my social medias and stuff like that. And yeah, but like, look at the growth, y'all. I really, I really like my hair has grown so much. Like, I'm, I'm top knotting now. I'm top knotting now. Who knew I could do a top knot bun? Like, it's a bit nappy or whatever because I fell asleep with it. But I mean, I'm just gonna go wash my hair. I have a wash day routine up on my channel already. So y'all can go watch that. Um, watch that. I'm gonna come back when it's time to blow dry my hair out. And we just gonna get to this video real quick and real smooth. But yeah, this is my hair. Um. Yeah, there's really not much to say. I haven't washed it in like a month, I think. But we're gonna wash it right now, so it don't even matter. It don't even matter. It don't even matter. <laughs> Let me stop. But yeah, I'm gonna just talk to you guys later when it's time for me to do all that stuff. So it is later in the night now. Um, I've already washed my hair and everything. I just ran my hair through some cold water. I put some leave-in conditioner in it. And um, I had like appointments to do, like stuff to do today. So I went to go do that. And then I was just wearing my Afro out. Right now I'm just gonna get ready to blow dry it. I'm just combing out this little section right here. I'm gonna comb out all the sections first and then put them in the, um, what do you call it? I'm gonna put them in ponytails and then we just gonna get straight into it. You know what I mean? I have my hair in four sections, but I'm going to be blow drying them in two. So I'm going to be blow drying them in eight sections, basically. I'm going to split um, one section in half and then blow dry that one little section and then blow dry the next. I feel like that's just going to be easier for me because I, yeah, I feel like that's just going to be easier for me. The back of my hair has kind of like a little bit of heat damage, but it's not bad. You know, it's not bad. And the back of my hair is already looser, so yeah. I'm gonna be straightening my hair and then I'm gonna be like trimming it too cause I haven't trimmed my hair since like um, seventh grade. And the time I trimmed that, I didn't really know how to trim my hair. So it was kind of like a mini big chop or yeah, it was a big chop basically. That was the time when I first like cut my hair and stuff. And now my hair on the sides is like shorter. But I mean, I don't really care to be honest. Hopefully me trimming my hair now is gonna help. No, it's not because they're growing at a different pace now. But I mean, I don't really care. I don't really care. I don't really wear my afro out. Like this was like the first time in, since like seventh grade where I wore my afro out. It was really nappy, it got nappy because outside it's like humid. We're about to have a dust storm and stuff, so. It's like humid and hot. And my hair, when I went out, was like damp. And then, you know, if you have 4 hair, you know. So I'm just gonna blow dry this section out first. So I'm just gonna comb it out and everything. I'm gonna start from the back and then make my way up to the front. Okay, y'all, so got my little blow dry. This is not mine's, but I'm borrowing it. It's Remington. It don't got no other numbers, but it's a Remington blow dryer. I haven't done like a natural hair video in a minute. Okay, so I'm going in with this Chi Silk Infusion. I honestly don't even think this is a heat protectant, but I see a lot of people um, use it. So I'm gonna just go with them because everybody says it's good. I'm just gonna go in with a little bit. A little goes a long way. Rub it in between my hands. Cause I don't want my hair to be too heavy and stuff like that. Make sure you get the ends, even though the ends are gonna be cut off and stuff. So I have this little section right here. 
I'm gonna go in with my paddle brush and I'm just gonna brush it out even more to make sure all the kinks are out. That word is so cringy. Like, I'm just gonna speed this process up and stuff because I don't think you guys just wanna see me blow dry my hair. You guys can't even hear me talk, so. I'm gonna do it on the highest setting with the highest heat. You gotta blow dry this to be as straight as possible, so I'm gonna really take my time and put in work to do this. Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel like chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be Okay, so that's the first section done. I feel like this is the straightest I can wait. I could, I could probably do the ends a little bit better. So I'm just gonna go back and do the ends again. Okay, so this is a bit better. It moves, so I feel like it's gonna be fine. The ends are kind of a little bit puffy. <sighs> I feel like this is the best I can do. I'm gonna change shirts because I need something a little bit more flowy. Now that we've changed shirts, I'm just gonna do the next se section. Yeah. There's really not nothing to really discuss because I'm just really blow drying my hair. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. I'm not really like. This is probably like my. This is my second time blow drying my hair out. Wait, third time? Well, second time by myself. I've had my hair blow dried out, but it wasn't by me. You know what I mean? So I don't know if that really counts. <laughs> So the company that gave me a straightener, um, they gave me a glove and I'm gonna wear that because I'm burning my fingers right now. I'm burning my fingers, so I'm gonna go get that glove. The glove that they sent me, it um, says Duval on it. And I'm just gonna wear this because my hands is literally burning. They're burning. Turn me inside out, out, make my heart beat. Leave no one else. You're all I need. Personality, everything you do makes me love everything about you.
So it's the next morning and I'm about to start straightening my hair. This is how my hair looks. Um, I'm gonna go through it again and blow dry it because um, I can tell my roots have puffed back up. But um, yeah, still not that much I gotta do to blow dry it. I'm just gonna go through it one more time. I just wanna make sure everything is like blown out to the best that it can be. So scared for this because this um straightener gets hot, like it gets hot. I burn myself from it sometimes. So I already know like it's gonna press my hair out. And if it doesn't, <laughs> it's probably just my hair because I have 4C hair. It's not because of my hair. Let me not even say that. Let me not say it's because of my hair. Um because 4C hair can do um soap presses too. So yeah, but I hope this comes out right because I want to be able to take pictures and stuff. I'm just gonna go through with my powder brush one more time, blow dry it again, and get the best blown out I can get. Get the get it the, the get it fuck get it blown out to the best of my ability. Okay, so I think this is the best I can blow it out to the best of my ability. So um, I'm just gonna start. I'm so scared. But um, I just want to, before I get into this video, I just want to show you guys who made this video possible, which would be Duval. Thank you, Duval, for sending me this straightener for me to try out for my subscribers and try out for y'all. I do have a code. It will be on the screen. I'm pretty sure it's 70 or 75% off on this straightener. And that's good because this straightener is kind of a, a bit expensive. But if you use my code, then it'll be cheaper, like. It's a titanium plate, um, plate straightener. It goes up to 450. As you guys can see, can you guys see? It goes up to 450, and um, the straightener is really nice. I've been using it on my wigs and stuff, and um, this gets the baby done. In, I mean, baby straight in like one pass. So hopefully, it can do that to my hair, cause ah! you guys already know it came with this glove too. So I'm gonna be using this glove because I don't want to burn myself because I've burned myself with this straightener before. So you gotta be very careful with the straightener, I would say that, because it gets really hot, which is a good thing because you need the hair to be. Stiff way. That's what we need the hair to be like, so. And this gets hot fast as hell, bro. It gets fast, I mean, hot fast as hell. So what you do to like get to the temperatures and stuff, you just click this button. The power button until like the power the the desired heat i'm gonna do it on 410 and we'll see how good that goes and i'm just gonna go in with my chi and i'm just gonna go one more time just with a little bit because i don't want my hair to be heavy and oily but i just want to make sure my hair is all protected and stuff like yeah and i'm probably gonna go with my through with my hot comb in the front We'll see how good this straightener can get them. Probably the nape of my neck too. Make sure you're getting the ends because the, that's the oldest part of your hair. My hair is kind of still puffy, but I feel like it will press it out. <sighs> I'm kind of scared, y'all. I'm kind of scared, but it's so if it doesn't come out right, I just know like I'm not that good at straightening my hair because this is my first time doing this. So I'm kind of scared. I'm just gonna split my hair into to two sections and I'm just gonna clip this to this side no it's not gonna reach okay I'm just gonna like make one big section I mean not one big section but I'm just gonna part it baby you don't know and first pass so let's go I will be cutting my ends too. I'm not passing the strainer more than twice through my hair. I feel like it's not gonna come out right, but we're just gonna do the whole thing because I can I have another style in mind that I wanna do if it doesn't come out right, so. 
So this is the first section. Stiff wear. Stiff wear. Stiff wear right here. It's probably because I didn't blow my hair out best, but it was blown out better yesterday. I really don't want to go through all that work again because I'm literally so tired. I'm going to get my scissors. I'm going to cut right here. All of that was dead. I cut a lot off, but hair is hair, okay? I don't really care. I'm just going to go through the next section. Oh, I'm going to pass it one more time. Give it a little bump. My hair looks pretty healthy though, besides that. I hope I don't get no damage though. But if I do, it's okay, because hair grows back, so it don't even matter. Okay, kind of looking better now that I'm okay. I really don't care like <laughs> I really don't care yeah I'm definitely gonna go through with a hot comb on my kitchen and stuff cuz <laughs> That was way shorter than I intended it to be. Oh my god. My hair is about to be all choppy. But it's okay, because I'm about to bump the end anyways. I'm gonna bump it up with like the 450. I wanna see like how good that presses on my hair. I'm kind of scared now after I like wash my hair and stuff how my hair is gonna turn out. Cause I already know heat damage is gonna come. Especially the back of my hair cause I already have some heat damage back there too. So I wasn't even recording bro. But um, I this is the section I just did. Um, it did make a difference. But um, I hope my hair does not get no heat damage. Which it probably will, but what can I do? Okay. Thought it would be flowy by now, but it's giving a little bit stiff. <laughs> it's okay. Baby, you don't know. 
what you do to me between me and you i feel a chemistry i won't let no one come and take your place because the love you give you can't be replaced stuff <laughs> what umaira looks healthy so I should have done my whole head on 450. Um, the front is more slowly than the back. But I'll just run it again. <laughs> that seems so dangerous. But. My ends are so dead, like, that's probably why they're not flowing, because the top is pretty straight. I need to go to, like, an actual hairstylist and get my ends trimmed <laughs> so they can get rid of the dead ends. <laughs> my hair is so uneven. I do not care, or we do not care. I kind of turned off my camera and forgot to can come back, but this is my surprise, y'all. Why? Oh no! Step one, my hair, yo. Mm. Nah, bro. This one is way much better though. The way I cut it, it's so uneven. <laughs> but I honestly don't even care. Like, it, it is what it is. Step four. My hair. <laughs> Ooh. Mullet? This is crazy, bro. I mean, this is my first time. I feel like I did the best I could do. But, you know, my ends on this side, they need to be cut more. But I'm not going to even cut any more of my hair. I'm just going to leave that for the stylist when I go to one eventually again. I don't know what to say. <laughs> I thought I could do this. I probably just have to go to professional and get my hair straightened or something. Let me try bumping the ends to like, you know. Nah, I'm just like burning my hair now. If you guys want to go get the straightener, the straightener is actually good though. I'm not going to even cap. Because I've done this before in the past, like last year, and my hair was stiffer than this. Like, it didn't even move. Like, I'm shaking my head right now, and it's moving. But the last time I did this with like another straightener, <laughs> it was so stiff. Like, it didn't even move. This is how the eyeshadow blown on my hair. But I, it was hard for me to do. I was using a paddle brush. Like, Anyways, yeah, I did not cut enough of the dead ends because it's why it's nappy at the ends. I want to put in the ponytail and see how it's gonna look. Step one, my hair. I strained my hair. Did it? Big fail. But I mean, what can I do? But if you guys would like to go get this straightener, make sure you guys use my code. It's down in the description box below and it's on the screen again for you guys to go purchase. Um, I use this on my wigs, like I said. Very nice. Um, I love it. But make sure you guys follow my social medias and stuff. Subscribe because my, I'm pretty sure my hair is damaged. Um, so, you know, that will make me feel better if you guys subscribed. So, um, yeah, we're just gonna get out this video. There's nothing else to say. Um, all my socials are down in the description box below. I know for a fact my hair is damaged, but what can I do? Nothing, nothing at all. But yeah, y'all.
Deuces. Cha-dun, cha-bye, cha-gone.